Have you ever found yourself stuck with a Motorola phone that's locked by FRP and wondered how to bypass the FRP lock on Motorola phone? You're not alone. Countless users have faced this frustrating situation, whether it's after buying a second-hand device, resetting their phone, or dealing with unexpected software glitches. But don't worry. In today's video, I'm going to walk you through some efficient methods to bypass the FRP lock on Motorola phone. Let's dive in. What's FRP on Motorola? Factory Reset Protection, or FRP for short, is a special security feature built into Android operating devices. It's designed to safeguard your data and privacy. If your Motorola device gets lost, FRP stops thieves or unauthorized people from using it. How does it work? It's quite straightforward. After you factory reset your Motorola device, you have to enter the username and password of the Google account that's linked to it. Without these details, no one can access your device. This makes it tough for hackers or intruders to break in. Even though FRP is great for security, it can be a headache for some users. For example, if you buy a second-hand Motorola device, the previous owner might not have removed their Google account details. And if you forget the username and password of your Google account, your device will get locked. Regardless of how you got locked out of your Motorola device, you can bypass the FRP lock. The following part of this video will focus on showing you how to do that. Method 1. Bypass FRP lock by recovering the Google account. If you can remember the Google email or phone, then open the browser on your computer and go to the Google homepage. Step 1. Click the sign in button, then enter your Google username or email. Step 2. Select forgot password, then follow the instructions that will show up. Step 3. After 24 hours of completing the password reset, Google will sync it across all of your devices. Method 2. Bypass FRP lock in simple steps. If you are stuck on the Motorola FRP lock, the most efficient method to bypass Motorola FRP is using DroidKit, Android Phone Toolkit. DroidKit allows you to remove the FRP lock in simple steps to get full access to your device, whether you lose your Google account or need to create one. Besides DroidKit can also help you unlock screen locks, fix or reinstall the system, recover lost data, and more. Next, let's look at how to use this tool for Motorola FRP bypass. First, open DroidKit on your computer and click FRP Bypass. Next, connect your Motorola device to your computer using a USB cable and click the Start button. Now, DroidKit will ask you to choose your device brand. Click Motorola and proceed. After selecting Motorola as your device brand, the tool will start preparing the configuration file for your Android device. Once prepared, select Start to Bypass. Then just follow the on-screen instructions to complete some settings. Finally, DroidKit will bypass the Motorola FRP lock. You will see the interface below as the process is complete, and your phone will restart without the FRP lock. Let's check whether DroidKit works or not. As you can see, the FRP lock has been bypassed. Above is all the content of the video. Thanks for watching. It is said that those who like it after watching this video will be luckier in 2025. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment.